it seems. So today I'm going to be doing a true religion try on haul. This is the first true religion try on that I've ever done on my channel. They do run as far as the like um, the clothes, not the jeans, but like the shirts, the sweaters, the joggers, they do run a little bit small. So I would say definitely size up. If you're normally a medium in a lot of sweaters or t-shirts, get a large. They have a lot of really cute stuff right now. I'll link the page that I shopped from, and then I will also link all of the specific items that I'm showing you in this video. Um, and I will also put the sizes and all that kind of good stuff. Um, but I will say the jeans fit very true to size. I'm usually a 29 in most jeans when they are like that kind of sizing, but I'm eight in normal jeans if it's not like a, you know, a size like that. Um, and they fit me perfectly. So 29 is like perfect. It fits like a glove. It's super comfortable. Their jeans are amazing. They're so, so stretchy and comfy. I feel like I could wear these all day long sitting on the couch editing like super duper comfortable. And also what I love is that they don't enhance my pooch because a lot of jeans when they come up too high, then it's just like, you know, whereas these ones, I feel like they have a lot of like support right in that zipper and it kind of tucks your lower tummy in which i really love um that's my problem area so absolutely love the jeans and then i have to say this jacket right here i haven't even taken it off and i'm super hot but i love it so much because it's so soft and i feel like a teddy bear and i love this beanie um but yeah let's just go ahead and get into the actual try on so you guys can see everything but i would say if you can pick any of those after watching this just keep in mind what i've just said jeans this little jacket and the beanie, absolutely hands down my favorite thing. Um, I also really love this little black top, but you'll see in a minute. So I hope you guys enjoy. Again, sizes will be down below, links will be down below to everything, and then I will link the main kind of like winter, um, like the new arrivals that I shopped from, because um, there is a lot of men's stuff, and there's a lot of other stuff as well. But um, they had a lot of really cute little cropped things. That's really not my jam, so I tried to get things that were like a little bit more, you know, not quite as, young and six pack abby um but yeah i've i'm really happy with this stuff that i got and i hope that you guys enjoy huge thank you to true religion for partnering up with me for this video i was so excited i had so much fun shopping on the website there's some super cute things so let's go ahead and try everything on love you guys and i hope you enjoy Okay, so here is the first outfit, and I just chose something to be comfy in. Um, I really like the fact that these pants have like zippers right here, and then they also have this little um, kind of ribbon that goes down right here. I think that's nice, and it kind of just breaks up the pants so where it's not just like all thigh, if you know what I mean. They do have like a little kind of design. This lighting is not great. Uh, it's like too dark in my bedroom and too bright in here. I just can't win. So see how they have that kind of like little design going down the side? Um, there is no design on the butt. It's just completely plain. You can see a little bit of cellulite. I'm trying to like really get some. So if you do have like a little bit of wiggle to your jiggle, you're probably gonna see it. And then you can, you know, pull them up high. I have them kind of just below the belly button. You have your metal zip pocket. Does it work? Yes, it is an actual real pocket and it's hard to do up with one hand. And then you do have your drawstring. So you've got a pocket on either side. This did not come as a set. I bought both different pieces just so you guys could see it as a set if you wanted to do it that way. Why is this lighting so weird in here? Oh, everywhere I go, it's bad lighting today. Oh, not cool. So here is what the sweater looks like. I kind of like how it does have like this hard ribbon bit right here because I do feel like it kind of keeps it away from like rubbing up against your makeup on your neck, which is kind of cool. You have the ribbon kind of um, true religion, whatever this material is, around the sleeves, around the neck, and then you've got your two zippers, and then you do have little metal on the actual um, high. I cannot talk anymore. All of my words are gone. Whatever these things are called. I'm like literally blanking out right now. So that is the first um, outfit I got. And this is definitely cozy. I mean, it's super comfortable. It is fleece inside, so it's nice and soft. 
and it's quite thin it's not like a super heavy like thick sweater so it's nice because it doesn't add bulk um, this would be really cute with jeans or you could just you know get it with the joggers as well I just feel like joggers are like so in right now you see them everywhere and honestly like they're just so comfortable to wear um, especially this time of year when it is a little bit chilly outside so I really like this outfit I think it's really cute and I really do like the color I like that kind of khaki green I'm really into it lately which is weird because like I never used to be but here I am and I do feel like I like the fact that this does have a bit of the Justin Bieber crotch going on because then it's not like not all up in your business and it's kind of like a little bit more casual don't know if it's the most flattering on my body type but honestly it's joggers and like who really cares you just want to be comfortable I did get a large in both of these I think the the fans the pants are perfect as a large but I'm kind of surprised at how small this sweater is for a large I mean, I normally wear a medium, and this is like, if I went any smaller than this, it would be tight on my arms. So definitely size up a full size for sure um, with both of them, I would say, because I feel, I feel like the large fits perfectly, and this fits perfectly on me, but can you imagine if I would have done medium? It would have been really tight. Okay, so next we have this outfit. I should have got a large. I got a large in the t-shirt. I got a medium in this jacket. It is like, I mean, it fits me, but I can't move, and I also cannot do it up at all <laughs> so uh, normally I can get a medium in jackets but again I think you need to size up with this brand I should have got a large so totes bummer for me but it is a really cute jacket I mean if I had this in a large I think it would be adorable the only thing is that I feel like it is gonna rub against my makeup right here so that's why I never really wear jackets like this but I really wanted to give it a go because I see people in jackets like this all the time and I'm like oh it's so cute I just don't think it's me but I think it's absolutely adorable and if it fit it would be even better but yeah you do have like so you could do it up <laughs> it's like literally so small on me um, you could do it up and then snap it there I think it's actually kind of cuter to just have open anyway um, it fits the arms fine it's just this area that it doesn't zip up on it does have little pockets right here which is kind of nice um, yeah I think it's a cute jacket let's see the back super cute I mean it's nice and fitted this way you know it just it won't zip up for me. So look how cute these are. I feel like they lift your booty really well and it's almost like the little logo makes it look like there's little eyeballs looking at you. So I'm really happy with the jeans. These are a 29 and these fit true to size so I love them. They have a good amount of stretch. They're super cute. So yes, love the jeans. So that's what they look like from the front. I obviously rolled them up because I put them on with like little booties. They do come down quite long on me, um, so I would have to roll them up even if I wasn't wearing booties, just because they come like way down onto my foot. Um, so just keep that in mind that if you are, but I don't really mind that because I always end up liking the way it looks better when I roll jeans up anyway. So, um, you know, I don't think that's a big deal. These are, I would say a mid rise. I don't think they're super high because it's kind of right below my belly button and I have kind of a short, um, you know, body. So, and they're nice. Like they don't actually like, I feel like they hold you in really nicely. There's a lot of good material right here, like right where I have a pooch that's like really doing a good job of like holding me in. So I think they're very flattering. They feel amazing, they're super stretchy. Like you could do yoga in these if you wanted to. I feel like from the side, they also make your butt look really lifted and super cute. Look at that. That's totes adorbs. And I like the little rhinestones on the butt. They look really cute. So yes, I'm really happy with the jeans. These are so, so cute, I love them. I think I could do without probably everything else in this outfit. But these jeans, I would absolutely say, like, these are super awesome. Um, and that's what I think True Religion is known for, is their jeans. These are amazing because they're so, so stretchy. And they're very slimming as well. I feel like they do make my legs look really nice and tight. Okay, next we have this t-shirt. Um, it does have the little True Religion logo right there. And it's just in kind of like a little red velvet. It's just a plain v-neck tee. It does come down longer if you need it to, which I think is nice. And it's, like, straight all the way across. I kind of just like it when it's like, you know, a little bit more folded over and casual. I prefer plain things a little bit more on the back, so it's not my typical thing that I would go for, but it is cute and I think it's a nice t-shirt. It fits well, um, but yes, it is nice. It's soft, it feels good, it has a nice good v-neck, so it's a good like everyday t-shirt. Um, you know, just keep in mind that there is that massive logo on the back. Next is same jeans but this top is different. This is very tight, it's very form-fitting. Again, I got a medium, 
Um, I actually think that the medium looks nice because I think it is supposed to be a form-fitting t-shirt. I think if I got a large, it would kind of just fit me strangely. Um, so yeah, I think that it is actually kind of like supposed to be more kind of you do it to the skin. So form-fitting that I don't think you could wear a tank top underneath because then I feel like it would be bunching up around it. Um, so just keep in mind that it is a little bit more revealing in the chest area. This shirt is actually very slimming. Like, I think it actually looks very nice on me, which is surprising because I don't normally wear, like, tight things. But I actually do really like it. It does have a hood. Where is the hood? Okay, so obviously I have a be Oh, wow, that's a big hood. I have a beanie on right now. I mean, obviously there's a pom-pom, so that looks ridiculous. But there is a hood, so that's kind of cool. I think it would actually be really cute for, like, um, working out. Like, you know, going outside and working out in because it's really quite an adorable little top and the material is unbelievably soft. It's super nice. It does have something on the back, so let's take a look at that. That's what it looks like from behind. So it does have a lot of words in silver. So what does it say? Autumn, winter, dream grunge, Los Angeles, street poetry, New York. So I'm not really sure what all that means, but I'm maybe someone will know and fill me in. Um, and then that's what it looks like, obviously, when your hood is down. I think it's cute though. I'm actually like really liking this top and the material is so soft that it just like feels unbelievable. And I like the fact that it's kind of tight fitting, you know, so that you could wear it under like, if you have a coat that's a little bit more kind of snug and you can't wear like big things like underneath it, I think this would be really great because you're still staying warm, but it's not like a bunch of material underneath something and then you're like claustrophobic. Also, this hat is so cute. Love the hat. It's got a pom-pom. My head's a little bit small, so there is a bit of a ridge right there. My head is like really little. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, and then I guess it does have that gold little metal um, logo right there. It has the little black pom-pom. And it's just actually a really cute beanie. I like the beanie a lot, especially with this outfit. I think as a whole outfit together, it's really cute. Especially if you had that little black jacket too. That would be totes adorbs. I'll just put it on just so you guys can see. But yeah, I think this is cute. I'm actually really obsessed with this shirt and these jeans and this beanie. This is my favorite so far out of everything I've tried on. This would be something that I would wear a lot. Okay, yeah, so with the jacket, it looks really cute, doesn't it? It's super adorable. I feel like it's actually really cute. Still not my jam. It's really not my style. I don't know. I, I always want to, but I just, I just feel like it's just not me. Um, it's a little bit too, like, BA for me, you know, I'm more of like a little sparkly fairy, um, but I feel like there's like Taylor, Taylor Wynn, she changed her name, um, she would totally rock this, uh, yeah, I feel like she would look so cute in this, but anyway, that's like her vibe, you know, my vibe is really not this, but it's always fun to give it a go, um, but yeah, so as an outfit, I think that is really cute, I mean, I think this is super adorable, I love the gold with the zipper, and then it matches the little beanie, Super adorable. This is my last outfit, and this jacket is so soft, you guys. I wore, I got this with the hood so that I could wear the hood over the neck just because it is white and it does come up high, and if you wear foundation like I do, or self-tanner, that will rub across your neck and you will stain it, and that's horrible. So that's why I got this little hooded shirt that I was wearing in the last one, just to wear over the top. Um, so that it protects my neck because I don't want to ruin this because it's so cute. So it's kind of like this um, velvet It almost looks like it's like a padded like parka, but it's more like actual like velvet But it has like those kind of the stitching to make it look like that the velvet is not on the inside But it's like a really soft Kind of smooth. It's velvety here, but then it's like kind of a smooth material on the inside. It's nice because, I mean, it does add a little bit of bulk to you, but not majorly for like a really cozy, I mean, like I'm hot right now. It's a very warm coat. Um, and oh my gosh, these animals. I feel like for being so warm and cozy, it doesn't add too much bulk to you. It feels just like you're wearing like a little zip up hoodie, but um, it's super duper like, you know, luxury. It's very like soft and it looks really nice and it's super cute and you feel a little bit snazzier than just wearing a hoodie, but you feel as cozy as you're wearing a hoodie. So that's really cute, I love it. And then if you don't have the hood, it basically just looks like, you know, like that, where you can like do it up all the way. But again, I wear makeup, so that's never a good idea. Um, but if you're someone who is a bare face, a bare face, who is bare faced, then you could wear that all the way up and that would be super cute. I just have to be careful. Um, but if I was wearing no makeup, then I could zip it all the way up. 
Um, and then these jeans are super cute. Let me pull this up so you guys can see what they look like. So again, I feel like they're kind of like a mid-rise. They don't come up super high. Um, they have this cute little pocket right there, which I think is really adorable. Very true religion. Um, really great fit. Again, these are a 29. They fit amazingly. They're super stretchy, really comfortable. I love the rips in the knee because it doesn't let your fat spill out. The pockets are... That's how deep they are. So they're not super deep, but they're still like Does anyone ever really put anything in jean pockets? I don't think so But you know, sometimes it's just nice to have them. Also, there's a sticker in there That's what they look like from the side. So again, really cute I feel like that's a nice thing about true religion is that it does do something for the booty and they're very slimming I mean, I feel like they do look really nice on and then that is what they look like from behind so Where did I just put that sticker? I just like disappeared um, they do come up, you know, semi-high, but not too much. They've got the cute little pockets. Really cute. I feel like it does make your bum look really nice. So, love the jeans. The two jeans are such winners. Like, I'm so happy I got them. And I'm so glad I got a 29 because they fit me perfectly. And then that is what the jacket looks like from behind. So cute and cozy. <gasps> I just feel like a teddy bear. Oh, and the pockets of this are really good size as well. So yes, love this. I love the jeans, love the jacket, love this little shirt underneath, love the beanie. Okay guys, so there is my haul, my try on. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a comment down below which outfit was your favorite. And of course you could mix and match that sweater with the jeans. Everything will be linked down below. As always, I'll put my sizes down, down below, down, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. I will put my sizes down below as well so that you guys can um, know reference. Of course, my actual sizing like all my measurements will be down there as well. Um, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed and leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite one was. Don't forget to subscribe, uh, click the notification bell, and of course, follow me on Instagram. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm still doing Vlogmas. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.